Go ahead. John, I got some more of this stuff. All right, go ahead. Just let me read this one. Yeah. Let me read something back in 16. This is camera coming And I have put my word in thy mouth, and I have covered thee in the shadow of my hand, that I may plant the heavens and lay the foundations of the earth and say unto Zion, thou art the people. Awake, awake, stand up, O Jerusalem, which have drunk at the hand of the Lord the cup of his fury. The cup of his fury. You know, that, you know, because we don't follow the commandments of the Lord. So that's why he's smitten us. Go ahead. Thou hast broken the dredges of the cup of truth. Oh, that, yeah, that's that scripture right there. They drunk, drunk the dredges. What is, how you say that? Dredge? Dredge, right. Dredge. That's like that old nasty, the bottom of the, you know, you get to the bottom of the bottle. It's all nasty. 40 ounces. Of the ball, ball yeah, all, yeah. <laughs> they don't really want to drink that. Yeah, they can drink it, though. They put the sugar beyond the bottom. They still drink that shit. <laughs> it's still you can have Kool-Aid in it. <laughs> they ain't been mixed. <laughs> right. I ain't drank Kool-Aid in years. There is none to guide her among all the sons whom she hath loved for us. Neither is there any that taketh her by the hand of all the sons that she hath loved for us. These two things are come unto thee, who shall be sorry for thee. Desolation and destruction. Desolation and destruction. And the famine. And the famine. And the sword. The sword. By whom shall I come from thee? That's a good one. That's so, what, a, that's a good one. so what's up with all this happy nice guy stuff, everybody? Oh, Y'all ain't talking about enough love. Jesus is the love. God is love. <laughs> God is all love and he created this world. Where's all the love at in the world? Where's the love? He created this world, didn't he? Yeah. They're like, oh, that was Satan that created that. But Satan ain't created a goddamn thing. <laughs> yeah, look. Uh, Isaiah and Satan's taking orders. Isaiah 45 and 7. Let me get that real quick, just to... Uh, in case people don't believe us. You can put them on a diet plan, right? Purify with fire. Now you're gonna hear a lot of sizzling when our fire hits. All that, all that pork grease. Let me get this, Isaiah 45 and seven. I formed a light and create darkness i make peace and create evil i the lord do all these things right because people always try to say god created love but satan created the, the, the evil and the hate that's a lie the most high uh the one y'all call god his name is yahweh in the bible he said he creates good he creates evil okay he's the one that makes peace he's the one that causes death he created everything that ever existed let me read up a little bit of this. Drop down ye heavens from above and let the skies pour down righteousness. Let the skies pour down righteousness. That's when that fire gonna come out of the sky. Let the earth open and let them bring forth salvation and let righteousness spring up together. I, Yahweh, have created it. Woe unto him that striveth with his maker. Let the potsherds strive with the potsherds of the earth. Shall the clay say to him that fashioneth it, What makest thou or thy work? He that hath no hand. Woe unto him that saith unto his father, What begettest thou or to the woman? What hast thou brought forth? Thus saith Yahweh, the Holy One of Israel and his maker, Ask me of things to come concerning my sons and concerning the work of my hands commanded me. I have made the earth and created man upon it. I, even my hands, have stretched out the heavens and all their hosts have I commanded. Hey, that's a good point, too, though. It's like, what went to him to strive with, with his maker? That's, the, that's the two thirds of Israel strive with their maker. That's why they got a problem when we come out. <laughs> but you should be lucky you weren't here last week. You probably wouldn't have gone to jail. <laughs> <laughs> that was the spirit.
Because they were striving with their makers. Is the scripture say, woe unto him that strives with his maker. That's what most people, they striving with the most high. That's a battle you can't win. You are of your father. Right, you are your father. I got it. Amos 3 and 6. Shall a trumpet be blown in the city and that people not be afraid? Right, shall a trumpet be blown in the city and that people not be afraid? Because right now we are here blowing the trumpet. You're blowing it, you know, that's a metaphor for teaching this word, for teaching the gospel, right? And so, right, people are supposed to get afraid. People are like, y'all, y'all bring, y'all teaching fear, y'all spreading fear and hate. Yeah. Read that again. So, yeah. trumpet be blown in the city, and the people will not be afraid. Do not the, the Lord command you to fear him, right? Go ahead. Shall not there be evil in the city? Shall not there be evil in the city? I will have not done it. And so that was the Most High. Uh, the Most High brought that evil. It wasn't. He used the Satan. The Satan. People think Satan is like an equal to the Most High and stuff. Like 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 uh, like there's a quarter. Most High was head and Satan was a tail. You know what I mean? That's that bullshit. When you read the scripture, it tell you that pretty much Satan worked for the Most High. The, the base, the Most High. Hey, I'm gonna get a scripture for that too. Uh, I, I got a precept for this. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of the fools. Fools despise wisdom and instruction. That's all we're doing to bring out wisdom and instruction. Like, it ain't like we just coming out here just trying to punk people and shit. Trying to look like some you know badasses or whatever. No, we come out and give them that wisdom and instruction. To fear the Lord. To fear the Lord. Teaching you what we know. <laughs> the people get they want fighters and stuff, you know what I mean? Uh, I'm trying to find it. This is one of uh, What's that one scripture, man? Oh, I got it. Mark 6 and 7. Like you saying that uh, even Satan himself fears the Most High, right? Or he obeys the Most High. But, you know, you're supposed to curse Satan still. But he ain't got no power of the Most High. Well, I got this one. Uh, Mark 6 and 7. And he called him, and he called unto him the 12, the 12 disciples, and began to send them forth two by two and gave them power over the unclean spirits, meaning the devils and demons. So the de even the demons obey us. You know what I mean? Because the demons obey you how a shot. That's why you know you feel them spirits or whatever. You, say you feel, you know how you ever feel like you got some demons around you or something, some shit don't fucking feel right. Now you just curse them in the name of your house by some your house shot. They got another one too though. Oh, here, I got one, uh, Mark 3 to 11. Let's get that Mark 3. Yeah, because Mark go heavy into this, uh, this, uh, the demons and stuff. Hey, you can even read in the, uh, when the, Satan tempted the Lord in the wilderness. The Lord cursed Satan out. He rebuked him, and then Satan left his ass alone. Uh... What you got? Go ahead, bring it up. Oh, the missiles. Oh, you didn't let them get off one, another one gonna go. It's uh, Luke 10, 17. It says, and the 70 return with joy, saying, Lord, even the devils are subject unto us through thy name. Even the devils are subject unto us through thy name. Right, through the name of Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Shad. Even the devils, these devils, they, they obey us, all these unclean spirits. I beheld Satan as lightning fall from heaven. Lord, I forgive unto you, 
Gentiles and shit. And see, that's not talking about the actual state, because according to Christians, uh, uh, that already happened, you know, during the time of Genesis, so that wouldn't make a damn sense. If you're just not born with heaven, whatever. I know Yeah, but well, really, it's, it's really going to Satan, it's really talking about Esau, too. It's fallen from heaven, we've fallen from the power, because he got no power. Right now, Satan's in heaven right now. Because heaven, uh, and his, his heaven is would be a rulership, right? Right now, this is this is heaven for the devil. In America, this is this is for, this, for, the, for these devils. This is they ain't fucking heaven. But this is, this is hell for us. So soon, Satan gonna fall from heaven. Hey, just like uh, the scriptures say in Revelation the twelfth chapter, which is in the New Testament, which says, which was written thousands of years after the flood and all that. It says what? Satan was cast out of heaven. It said there was a war in heaven and Satan was cast out, you know, by the angels. The angels of Michael, the Lord, cast Satan out of, out of heaven, which that's a future prophecy which has not yet been fulfilled. I give unto you power to tread them on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. And nothing shall be any man's hurt you. Not, notwithstanding, that this rejoice not, that the spirits are subject unto you, but rather rejoice because the names are written in heaven. The names are written in heaven. That's that book of life. You know what I mean? We've already predestined. The scripture talking about predestination. They said we was chosen before the earth was even formed. I got, I got another good point too. They go Satan don't like that. Satan. Fuck you, Satan. As soon as you say that, yeah, you go. And damn tornado and shit. Hey, but the proof though, there's no such thing as Satan from, uh getting kicked. They got this story. They said that Satan got kicked out of heaven. When did that happen? I get. They said it happened before the flood, right? Because you had the fallen angels in Genesis six. They claimed. So if they say they said before the flood, Satan got kicked out of heaven. Then how come after the flood in the book of Job was Satan reporting to the Most High in perfect obedience to the Most High? That don't make no sense. Don't make no sense. Fair <laughs> Jake loves his stories, man. He really does. He's a full picture storyteller. Jake a master storyteller, boy. Hey, he's the best liar too. Yeah, today's Labor Day. Hey, that's good. We out here laboring. What are you talking about? The Judite bitch? Oh, I didn't see her. Ass city. So the that really, hey, that goes what would that say? Satan gonna kick, get kicked out of heaven soon. What did it say? I think in another one of the gospels it actually say Satan. So we know this is talking about Satan himself. And when he had fasted 40 days and 40 nights, he was afterwards and hungry. And they go to that number 40. You know, see that, that, that number occurs a lot in the scriptures. Like it was during the flood, it rained 40 days and 40 nights. You know what I mean? The tempter came to him, he said, And thou be the son of the most high command that these stones to make rain. But he answered and said, It is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mountain of the most high. 
Right, he cursed the devil out. Man shall not live by bread alone. Then the devil taking him up into the holy city and setting him on the pinnacle of the temple and said unto him, Thou be the son of the most high, cast thyself down for us. He shall give his angels charge concerning thee, and in thy hands they shall bear thee up, lest at any time thou dost be the pastor for the house of the Lord. And thou shalt send unto him. It is written again, Thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy power. And again, the devil taketh him up into an exceedingly high mountain, and showed him all the kingdoms of the world and the glory of them, and said unto him, All these things will I give thee, and thou wilt fall down and perish. in America, you know. He showed him all the kids in earth. He showed him America. You know, just like when he was committed, freedom of the Lord was crying my last when the Lord agreed, like, like, you know, like, he should know, you know. <laughs> that's funny, too, it said Satan said he would give, give him the kingdom. That tells you what, that the, uh, that the Most High given Satan dominion over the earth. Yeah, this is Satan's kingdom right here. And Satan, Satan was offering this piece of pile of shit to the Lord. How are you gonna offer the Lord a pile of shit like that? Give me a pile of shit. All you gotta do is bow down to me. I give you this pile of shit. You gotta be out your mind. Oh yeah. Whole <laughs> four is a whole state. Like that shit, seeing that hole right there. Right. Bitches twerking. Yeah. You see a bitches twerking. That's the nastiest shit I've ever seen a ass shake. Oh, she's taking pictures. Oh, nasty. They've been pissed there, spitting. She's going to go straight to Facebook. She going to get all the thumbs up. Oh, girl, on Facebook, all the comments about, girl, you look so good. Like, hit me up. Uh, there was a delicate, I can't remember his name, but there was a Catholic priest that said that the woman is a delicate vessel built upon sewers. Damn. <laughs> These bitches don't give a fuck where they lay and say what they do. You know? They're stupid and filthy. They ain't raised right. This the Lord seen. He saw these women too. Yeah, he's seen them. Yeah, and you notice the two that the Lord, he, he, there's no account of him in the scriptures ever having a woman. You know what I'm saying? So, tell, where is his mind at? Right. He it's said, "The hell with the woman." For spiritual gifts. Right. Yeah, you, you know, people be like, uh, "Oh, he married Mary Magdalene." And they say he married. <laughs> they say he never died. Married Mary Magdalene fled to Europe. And he, he, he said he got, she got children too. Yeah, he got children. They say he he was the head of the Merovingian family. <laughs> Well, fucking Jake, boy, I think come up some stories for your ass. And he and said unto him, All these things will I give thee if thou wilt fall down and worship me. Then said Gehalashai unto him, Get thee hence, Satan, for it is written, Thou shalt worship the Lord thy power, and him only shall thou serve. Then the devil leaveth him, and behold, angels came to the ministry. The angels came to minister. Hey, that's the spirit, though, because Satan was like, all right, you passed the test. Yep. Remote, yep. I was vexed all week long. Mad as hell, man, because I couldn't crack the bitch in front of him. Oh, bro, ever since last week. <laughs> I was mad as a motherfucker all week long, man. Oh, I had that bitch's fucking annoying ass voices that M is replaying in my head over and over. Cause I'm known to smack a hoe. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm known to smack a hoe, man. Bitch kept saying I had white Shit. privilege. She's like, what are you doing? You need, no, she kept saying, you need to do more to help black people. That's what she kept telling me. I was cracking up. Like, what you want me to do, bitch? Yeah. I was cracking the fuck up. She want me to go get an AK and run up on some motherfuckers or something? That still wouldn't make you happy. You can't. No, I'm really thinking she was part of Antifa or something. Some somebody said a brother dropped a comment said she was either BLM or Antifa. That could be true. Could be. The, the anti. 
they said about the Jews, the anti food, the communists. Yeah, they're supposed to be anti government. And, 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 she, and she said she came out of the university. She said she was smarter than us and to prove it that she had a college education. So that's where she learned all that shit was in that, that college. They teach them all that bullshit, that, that whacked out, uh, that whacked out liberal shit she was talking about. They instructed her. I watched her. Everywhere you know she got money too. She got money, bro. You can tell she got money. Yeah, I think somebody did send her out here. Is that what she said? Seem like she was acting though. No, yeah, Brian seemed rehearsed. Everything seemed rehearsed. Yeah. Well, she knew exactly what she was doing when she walked up. And she knew exactly what she was doing. She got to this side right here. She kept the biggest deal. All right. This is the first question she asked for. So I'm going to get the deal. I'm talking about it. I'm rehearsing. And she twisted my words and said, I'm going to go Woman. She just immediately just started Watch the video. Time we got to start because you got an anti foot coming up against the right wingers. So because they're getting bigger and bigger, they're gonna start sending them up against the camp. Yeah. They, they don't like us being out here. Yep. They really they do not like because there's a lot, especially GMS, bro. There's a lot of camps out there, man. If you just type, just type in GMS on YouTube. And look up all the camp pages that pop up. That shit is endless. And they, 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 do, they do not like anybody out here doing what we do, man. So they are gonna start sending, they gonna start sending their little agents out here. Yeah, he's an agent. Gotta be. Yep. Why is Vocab going away? He said he's from Columbus. Okay, Vocab. He was trying to get us to go out. He was like, you guys want to come see Spider-Man? He reminds me of your boy on uh. I'll go ahead and you about that. He said, I don't know, man. He was funny, man. Come on, you guys want to go see Spider-Man meet my family? He's like, you can bring your kids with you. He tried to indicate what the script said, gift destroyed my heart. He's trying to entice us with a gift. He, you know what I'm saying? He's paying for it and everything. Who the hell argued with somebody and said, hey, you want to watch Spider Man? I was tempted to, boy, because I wanted, I still ain't seen that new Spider Man. It's fucking stupid. Is it? Fuck. How can you fuck up a Spider Man kid? Yeah, they're corny as hell. They got good reviews. I thought it'd be oh, good. No, it's, it's awful. Is it? It's awful. Personally, I thought it was awesome. He played a terrible man. He's a funny character. Yeah. He's a funny, serious, silly character. That motherfucker. Look. Uh, All right. Yeah. Uh, I was about to get off. Oh, yeah. Whatever. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'm going to get on the book. The Italian bitch. The Italian bitch. The Italian bitch. Yeah. The Italian bitch. Uh, I can't remember. Aunt May? Aunt May was fine. 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 Aunt May